enjoying the show, show your support for the live stream and the people making the show. Buy a super chat or super sticker on YouTube directly. Select your donation and type your message to the world and share. All donations go into directly funding new shows. Buy a super sticker or super chat now. Thank you. for the sport, for the world. That's why we're making a global showcase, starting in Europe, made in Amsterdam. UltiLeague.net We are a group of ultimate players, coaches and video enthusiasts. We've worked with the major federations and the greatest events. We're on a mission to make ultimate huge. We want our videos and live streams to be free to watch. We want to make stories that not only reach you, but also reach people outside the Ultimate community. Like and subscribe, Ultimate TV, the best in the world. Become a member and, and fund our, our work, work to cover more events in the future and to bring more stories and live coverage to the eyes of the Ultimate world and, and beyond. beyond. Right now, he's going to have to bid. Oh, just a, oh, just a <laughs> football. Huge layout block, unbelievable stuff on the front corner of the end. Zone. Maybe well. just that boost of the energy they needed. Always on the move? You can keep up to date with Ulti TV on all of our social media channels. Like, follow, subscribe, share us with a friend, or send us a message just to say hey. Thank you for supporting us in our mission to grow ultimate everywhere. Bichon picks up and they've got a short field. They've got another goal. It's tied up at 12. I cannot believe what I'm seeing Can here. Lola Dam chase that one down? That is a score for Hasliger Elferkel. Fantastic run by Julia Love. We're on a mission to make Ultimate huge. And we believe that that requires knocking down the paywall. We want our videos and live streams to be free to watch, and we want them to go viral. When you become a member, you enable us to improve our working relationships with tournament organizers, events and federations. And you'll help us to produce live stories for Ultimate fans, and to generate new fans with our enhanced content. We, we are, are a group, group of, of ultimate, ultimate players, players, coaches, and video enthusiasts, and we want to bring you coverage on a more consistent basis. We want to make stories that not only reach you, but also reach people outside the Ultimate community. Ciao ragazzi, support the community. And subscribe to Ultimate TV, there's lots of the videos, posting, everything, check it out. <laughs> they are the best one. Woo! If you want to grow Ultimate Sports, uh, become a member of Ulti TV. Regardez Ulti TV. Deviens un membre Ulti TV et fais grandir ta communauté. Top Ulti TV. Salme et rougincime Ultimate of Andromeda. Si quieres ayudar a Ulti TV, puedes ser miembro de Ulti TV. Thumbs up for Ulti TV. Everyone, follow Ulti.tv on Instagram, on YouTube. They've got everything. Best content. Like their pictures if you love free speech. Just do it. We're counting on you. Give me a love for Ulti TV. Became member of Ulti TV. TV. <laughs> <laughs> Contribute to development ultimate with Ulti TV. Like and subscribe, Ulti TV, the best in the world. We want to grow ultimate. We want to grow ultimate. We've worked with the major federations and the greatest events. We have our signature style two camera setup with thousands of hours of experience, and our crew is globally dispersed to facilitate coverage everywhere around the world. We can also scale back our broadcast with just one elevated camera. Or scale up with two fields, two cameras and two commentators on each. We work with local teams and we all have the same mission, to grow the sport and bring it to new people by providing live coverage and new stories. Become a member today on our Patreon page. And, and fund, fund our, our work, work to cover more events in the future 
and to bring more stories, ideas and live coverage to the eyes of the ultimate world and, and beyond. beyond. I was called Electric, become a member. The ultimate things in life are free, and we're keeping it that way. Subscribe to keep up with the latest games, tournaments, and community content. Share it with your team and friends, and drop a like to help spread Ultimate to more people. Spread the word, spread the love. Okay, back to you. Welcome back to Lithuania. For the last time this weekend, we are live in Prinai with the Open Division. The bronze medal match and the finals take place tomorrow over the Galivar venue. And of course, Ulti TV will be there. Full two camera setup. But in the meantime, one more game for you here in Prinai with our wonderful Zoom TV crew. It's the fifth place match between the hosts, Lithuania and the Netherlands. Benji Rees in the booth once more and as well as this a reminder that we also have games going on at the Galivar and Costa venues being broadcast live for you at the very same time so you can watch Denmark versus Latvia in the women's division or Belgium versus Turkey in the open division I say or in the mixed division rather and because obviously there's nothing stopping you from triple streaming and you might even say that's the preferred method of watching. It's the maximum ultimate consumption. Both sides would have had designs on being higher up the bracket. Lithuania lost in the pool stage to Belgium and then were knocked out in the quarterfinals by Latvia. The Netherlands won their pool but came unstuck in their quarterfinal thanks to a very spirited Ukrainian performance that I think maybe caught them off guard. <laughs> Netherlands receiving the pull. The Netherlands beat Sweden in their quote unquote semi final while Lithuania promptly dispatched Poland. Vanderwood is playing it in the backfield with Den Bryn. Nagaoka sticking the blade to Vanderwood. The implicit trust there from Georgi Nagaoka. Knew exactly what Vanderwood was wanting to do and knew that he could stick it.
strong start there from the Dutch. He's creating that separation laterally. Getting it over towards that far side. First time we're seeing the Lithuanian on offense now. Slobodskoyas. Knife caught by Golba. Vasokis. Zips it down the center. Sturbis. Oh, the scuba is sumptuous from Denisa Slobodskoyas. Wonderful, beautiful arcing trajectory. And Lithuania tie us up just like that, 1-1. One, one. Then Brin catches the pull. Blasman. Oh, miscommunication. Van der Wood tried to come towards it, but that was too late. I think Nagaoka left it. Didn't think it was for him. Trying to manipulate the mark around. Finds Mikenas running the upline cut. Now turns, looks in the backfield instead. Inside out, Zubovicius. Zubovicius being called to go backwards to McKenas. He does. And past the bidding, Denbrin. Slotted in there. Lithuania break. 2 1, they lead. You see Zubovicius, he's getting the call. Go backwards. It draws Nagaoka out of that space. Vacates it. And past the bidding, Den Breen. Mikainas fits it into Zubovicius. Van der Wood. Oh, the scuba looking for Blasman. And Blasman rips it down. Over Kenstutis Bachkis. Was it the highest percentage shot from Van der Wood? Certainly not. Was it the most entertaining? Yeah, it could well have been. And giving Blasman room to work. Sees that he's got the run to the break side. Floats up and Blasman just reads that so well. Despite the defender on his hip, going up nice and early. Wessels with the pull. Modestas Goba. Finds Dovidas Goba. Shalasevicius to Visokis. Visokis. Off balance a little bit, but he sneaks the blade in there. <laughs> Very well to take avoiding action. But he might have been out of the back. I think that's what the discussion is. Ah, yeah, the left foot does land on the line. Ten Harkin. He's got a dump free if he wants it, and he does take it. Wessels back to Ten Harkin. Squeezes that past Visokis into Mawson. Ten Harkin again. The Netherlands looking to get back on serve. Leish. Not the scuba. Instead, the backhand. He'll throw and go. Ten Harkin underneath. Leish is one on one in the end zone. Lee wants to get involved as well. Now Lee Leish comes to the open side. And we'll go backwards instead. Wessels. Ten Harken. Lish. Oh, the scuba is silky. Was Lee in bounds? 
players have differing views. Just going to get another look at it now. I suggest sending it back. It was really close. If I had to be pushed one or the other, I would have said in, but I'm not. I wasn't confident enough to call it. Lish to Ten Hagen. Mawson. Lee just about gets it off in time to Ten Harkin. Ten Harkin sticking this to Lish. I think that's too much, and it is. Visokis. Shalasevichus. Back in his hands now to Sturvis. Dovidas Golba into Modestas Golba. The two of them combine once more. Lithuania up 3-2. It's a disciplined red zone defense after the contested in out call. Force the Dutch back. And eventually they forced the turnover. And they pounced on their second opportunity. Paul is going to end up short. And Dembrin will bring it at the brick mark. Blasman and Nagaoka downfield. First pass is laterally to Artes. Now Artes wants to get involved. Nagaoka sticks it. Oh, it so nearly ended up in the hands of Artes. He got his hand there, but it's a really tricky read over his head, and it just goes out. Still count rising. Gets it off. That's a really good toe in there from Bobina. And now they're shooting for him again, calling his number. But not him, it's Zubovicius in the end. Somehow makes the catch. And he and Artes all over each other. And it's Lithuania 4, Netherlands 2. You can see that Mendelis wanted the hammer. Going up strongly against Artes, he tips it. And it's on Artes' body on his chest. And he just traps it there against his shoulder. Pulls a little bit too high. Dembruyen wants it from the brook mark. Dembrian underneath to Mawson, coming over to play on the O-line. Vanderwood. Wessels. Another player switching to O. Blasman. Blasman sees his target and he nails it onto Vanderwood. 4-3. You never want to let a team get ahead of steam going. Build up multiple breaks in a row. Your offense gets flustered. 
the defense feels that surge of energy. If you give one up, got to make sure your offense gets in it the next time of asking. Vasokis. Golba. Looking down the line for Visokis. Takes the hammer infield. Oh, that feels like a, a miscommunication, a blown switch. Slobodskoyos was asking if there was a pick. As Modestas Golba shows his jersey number. It's Lithuanian pride as well to the camera. And you can see there he calls for the switch and it's not picked up in time. Have to be more proactive rather than reactive on those. Artes will bring it in from the brick mark as that pull lands short. And immediately going for the scuba to Vanderwood, which he rips down. Wants to clear things up with it, so going back to Dembrin. Blasman. Scuba to Nagaoka in space. Blasman with Vanderwood. As a dump, he takes it. Artes, a couple of yards out to Nagaoka. We've got Van der Wood at the back. Can he stick it over the top? He can. And there's a sideline there who seems to think he's out. And Van der Wood ex accepts their perspective. Didn't get a great look at it from my angle. but the cameras might have got a better shot. Finn, appropriately, has Finny dust, but you can't really blame him because he's not got much room to go with on the sideline. But I, I must admit, does seem like he was out the back and that's out the side. Sakovic unable to bring it in. Artes, back to Nagaoka. Got plenty of time, Nagaoka. You just pop that one over the top to Artes. Artes and Nagaoka running the one-two, and they don't come onto it quickly enough, the Lithuanian defenders. And they pop it all the way into the end zone for the score. Run the gauntlet. Lithuanians getting some very vocal support from the sidelines. Dividers Galba to Shalasevicius. Strubis. Vasokis. Oh, is he going to do the hammer over the top? No. Dipping this one in. This is lovely indoors. Screaming for it on this near side was Vasokis. Dutch filling in the end zone well. But in bigger end zones, it's a lot harder to continually plug those gaps. Eventually, it feels like one will open up, and it does. Shalasevicius catching the goal. Dividers Galba on the assist. A reminder that we've got three pitches going on at the moment. It's the last game of the day here. 
in Prina and also at Kalsta, where there's women's division action with Hannah Pendlebury covering Denmark versus Latvia, I think it's their fifth place game. Meanwhile, there's a couple more games to go in Garlevar. There's Belgium versus Turkey at the moment. Christina Overmeyer is on the call over there. And there's still two more to come. Nagolka. What a skyscraper of a blade. And snatched out of the air with Blasman. I must admit, there was a point where I wondered if Nagaoki would fall foul of the various fixtures and fittings in the ceiling. Such was the tra trajectory of that one. But Blasman pinpoints it well. Vysokis instantly sticking it and jumping it into the end zone right in front of those Lithuanian supporters. Dividus Golba. And those are those LTU chants for Lithuania. I thought it's only ever had one thing in mind, really, didn't he? Then Breen. Oh, the offhand backhand for Blasman doesn't hit the target. What an opportunity this is, coming in right on that cone. Scoobering over the top, Vanderwood says no. He wants it all to Blasman and he's got it as well. How cruel the game can be. You've got a golden opportunity on the end zone line to punch in a break. It's ripped away from a great defensive play and Van der Wood instantly jacks it and Blasman brings it down a second that Van der Wood intercepted that Blasman was off nearly gets caught in the ceiling but it comes down safely Dividas Golba Vasokis, Strubis, Vasokis, Lithuania just playing it a bit more circumspect after the long bomb on the last possession. This time, I think there was, thought there was maybe going to be a discussion, a call. But it will be a Dutch disc. With Myers to Lee underneath. Oh! Myers was looking at the next pass and the disc wasn't quite where he thought it was. Vysokis is giving Salasiewicz the call to just go and be active, be engaged, be a threat so they can't ignore you. The Dutch do like to fill in the end zone. But in these big end zones, eventually they'll get you. Swibis with the score. Vysokis with the assist. 8-6 Lithuania, narrow lead here towards the end of the first half. The last game of the weekend here at Prinai.
Den Bruin. Going across, scubering up his Blasman. Thunderwood. Defender flashed in front of him, Zubovicius. And he lost it. And Mendelis will punish him for it. Zubovicius catching the break. And that is half time. Lithuania with a 9 6 lead. Okay, just gets a lot of air under this one. Vanderwood has to slow up slightly so we can go up for it. And Mendelis, this is ruthless, sees the opportunity, picks it up. Zibovic is to the end zone. Lithuania 9 6 up. Netherlands going to have to dig themselves out of a hole as you see these first half highlights. A penny for the thoughts of those in the Dutch huddle right now. Tiedate is giving the team talk for the Lithuanians. For Coach Zarekis. More of the same, you guess. Because the Dutch have not been able to get the break. They came so close a couple of times. But they just haven't got over the precipice. Extra bonus for the Lithuanians. And they're going to begin the second half receiving. I think it's the Lithuanian women's side who are being very vocal in their support. I'd love to see that. Not patriotism necessarily, but the camaraderie between squads from the same nation. So Lithuania hoping to put in a clean point here and get a four-point lead. Slobodskoyas. Vasokis, oh, just about squeezed that one in there. Really trying to manipulate the Dutch. With those fakes. Brief stoppage here. It's going to give an opportunity for Sturbis to do up his laces. The last thing you want is someone slipping over those and getting injured. Lish drawn to the front of the end zone. And you can see the swagger in the Lithuanians now. Dividas to Modestas Galba. 10 6 they lead. We've seen comebacks on this pitch this weekend, it can happen. But with the pomp and swagger that the Lithuanians seem to be playing with, it's a tough task. Den Bruin underneath to Vanderwood. Artes. Back to Vanderwood. Ooh, I think he wanted the scooper for a bit. Stead will punch it into Artes. Artes to Blasman, just on the end zone line. Nagaoka. Over the top. Dembrin. Blasman and Artes. He wanted to jump that in, but he was not there. And Blasman finds Nagaoki with the toe drag for 10 7. And we'll take a little bit of the air out of the sails of the Lithuanian sideline. See a couple of times they were wanting these jumps in, but need to be a bit more proactive about taking them. Fortunately, 
didn't quite matter because Nagoki was there was there anyway. that for Lithuania. The Gobas linking up once again. This time Modestus is the supplier. And Dovidas the scorer. Again keeping this four point lead 11-7. The Dutch defenders just looking a bit worn out on the back foot. Dembrun, oh the cheeky no look to Artes, I like that one. And then the defender bites into the backfield. Dembrun and Artes playing it between themselves. Beckham's Blasman out, Thunderwood fills in the end zone. Nagaoka loves those knives over the top. Blasman with the scuba for Artes, cool as you like. 11-8. Lithuanian offense back to work. Vesokis. Goba. I think Lee wanted to bid, but it wasn't quite there for it. And over the top, Vanderwood got sucked underneath it. And Goba trusted his read. And he got the rewards. 12 8. See what Vanderwood's trying to do there. Intercepted early. Not give the defense a shot at it. But slots about Skyos. Judge the depth well. Blastman. Nagaoka comes through underneath, so does Artes. Swung to Blasman in the centre spot. Dembrin. Ooh, faked off Artes because he can sneak that one through to Blasman. So, a nice field presence seeing that develop in the peripheral vision. Dembrin to Blasman for 12 9. Netherlands certainly not out of this. But with Lithuania playing well, it's going to be tough. Caught at the back of the end zone by Shalasevichis. And stuck deep. By Vysokis. Ooh, I think Goba landed on the line. But it doesn't matter because the Lithuanians flood forward. And Sturbis reaps the rewards. Still just pacing themselves out in front of the Lithuanians. Now that they've got this little cushion that they've built themselves. Now 
There's the idiosyncratic jump pull from Mendelis. Mates. To Nagaoka. Blasman. Over the top to Vanderwood. He's got Nagaoka free. And there's Artes available. Blasman as the end zone fills in. And Nagaoka jumps through to score. Too easy that, a little bit for the Netherlands. Nagaoki just steals a march on the defender there. And they were not really troubled at all, that possession. Ten minutes left till Cap comes on. Lithuania 13, Netherlands 10, the current score. That did hit one of the beams above us. Lobotskoyas. Modestas Gober on the far sideline. Pick downfield. You can see the proactive faking there as Vysokis. Blades towards the far sideline, Slobodskoyas. Vysokis, zipping it in to Golba. Golba to Slobodskoyas for the score. 14 10. The Netherlands not really found a way to pressure Lithuania in the second half, but then. I guess the Lithuanians haven't really found a way to pressurise the Netherlands in the second half because neither side has turned it over since the break. Nine points now without a turn in a row. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Although defensively, I think you'd be disappointed to not generate a little bit more anxiety for the opposition. Uh, Finn, I think you might have lost that boss one, mate. You won't have seen this, but he's chucked it over his head and he just rolled under the bleachers. Interesting chat. Timeout called. As the Netherlands try and cook something up here. Well, mercifully, he's got very long arms, so he's fine. The jump pull from Mendelis. Blasman. Going for the scuba to Vanderwood. And Nagaoka strikes. Wasn't a clean reception, but he did keep that foot in. Always nice off the timeout when you draw up a set play. And it works to perfection. Just classic indoors that. One player isolated in the center of the field. In this case, it's Vanderwood. Catches the throw to the walls of the break side, whichever side is not being marked on. And then the continuation cutter in the end zone off that. Nagaoka just takes the initiative and catches the score. Goba. Wanting the hammer. And the two of them combine once more. 15-11, Lithuania two points away from the fifth place finish. Moreskas to Dovedas, Golba. Still no turns in the second half. If the Netherlands can't snap that streak, it's sixth for them and fifth for the host nation Lithuania.
got Blasman, the ISO player in the centre this time. And they're going to try and play a more fluid system now. Artes, Blasman wasn't ready for it. Vanderwood, now Blasman is. Nice low release to Artes. Takes the free dump back to Blasman. He's got a little bit of time here. Dembrin. Vanderwood. Showing the hammer, just teasing it maybe. He is going to go for it, you know, and why not? Because Blasman catches for the score. Much to the chagrin of the home crowd. Just maybe a little extra obstacle that the Dutch have to battle against here. Some very frank discussions look like they're going on in the Lithuanian huddle. Must have been another timeout call that I didn't spot. I think maybe Lithuania are also playing the time a little bit here. Knowing it's their last opportunity to call one. Good opportunity for some highlights from the second half. I mean, that was a wicked break. Both sides back on the field. High fives going on. As the Dutch cross a lot of their key players over. Artes, Denbrin and Van der Wood. Joining usual D-line stalwarts, Jos Wessels and Aaron Mawson. Is that ball going to take the edgy one? I don't think it is. I think it's Hermansen. Sweden, who's catching it in the stands, that's a brick. Asakis march it up. Artes calling for communication from the sideline. And that never really got started because of the pick. This game from four. Asakis is going to have to get this out quickly at a really awkward angle. You could see how the pick disrupted the rhythm there because they had to get going again from neutral. First turnover of the second half, by the way. And there's the second. What a hand lock from Modestas Golba. And they're calling his number again and he beats Van der Wood for the double happiness. That's the bookend. 16-12, one away from victory. Slobod's guy has only just got that ahead of Wessels, but with Wessels committed and unable to apply the pressure with the force, Gobar up in front of Vanderwood. Bachkis with the ball. Dembrian catches to Artes. Showing the scuba to Blasman, no to Dembrian instead. See they're poaching off to try and prevent that isolation play. It's behind Van der Wood, but he makes the catch anyway. Now release backhand, lading down the sideline to Blasman, showing the scuba, going instead. Dembrian, Nagaoka. Getting it on the run. All the space opens up in front of him. And Blasman with the toe at the front of the end zone. 16-13. Now, do the Dutch have a break run in them? They'll need one. But it's a tall ask when the Dutch haven't broken all game. Over a minute left before the cap comes on, but of course that doesn't matter. As we know it's game to 17 at this point. 
Shalasevichus. You can hear the Lithuanian support roaring for the team on. Shalasevichus on the sideline. Sturbis. Foul in the center of the pitch. Dutch sideline trying to cheer up their counterparts. Stubbis down the line, showing the scuba no. Back in, we'll go back to Vysokis. Around, Shalasevichus. Gorba, underneath, Sturbis. Nor the hitter we play on as normal. Oh, where was the landing? They're pointing at a mark on the pitch. Going to see if we can run the replay. It would be some way to end the game. Wear it in. I think that right wrist that lands first is in bounds. 17-13, Lithuania with the victory. And Lithuania will take home fifth place as the host nation of this EUIC in the Open Division, the European Ultimate Indoor Championships. A well-earned victory against the Dutch side that just ran out of steam a little bit. Great performance from the Lithuanians. Their offense never broken in this game. And that is it here from Prunai this weekend. We've squeezed in 22 games at this venue over two days. That's an awful lot of ultimate, let me tell you. But we do still have two games left in the open division and they both take place tomorrow over at Gavrilva. When the bronze medal match, Latvia taking on Ukraine and in the gold medal match, Finland against Belgium. But that will do it for the meantime. Reminder, we still have a couple more games to come today over at the Gailivar venue. In the mixed division with Christina Obermeyer calling the action. But that is us done and dusted here in Prinai. A huge thank you to everyone who's watched us this weekend. A reminder to keep your eyes tuned to Ulti TV. Like and subscribe if you haven't already to, keep noti to get notified of when we go live. And as well, support us on the Patreon so we can help bringing you awesome tournaments and occasions like this in EUIC. A huge shout out to the Zoom TV crew as well, running the production here and over in Costa as well. Been an absolute pleasure and a delight to work with and hopefully our paths will cross again at some point in the future. I very much look forward to it, but that is us done and dusted. And I think I need to lie down so I'm fresh and ready for finals day tomorrow. On behalf of all of the Ultra TV and Zoom TV crew, as Lithuania beat the Netherlands to take home fifth place here at EUIC 2022. Benji Reese saying, we will see you on the other side when it's finals day.
Unity.tv. We are a group of ultimate players, coaches and video enthusiasts. We've worked with the major federations and the greatest events. We're on a mission to make Ultimate huge. We want our videos and live streams to be free to watch. We want to make stories that not only reach you, but also reach people outside the Ultimate community. Like and subscribe, Ultimate TV, the best in the world. Become a member and, and fund, fund our, our work, work to cover more events in the future and to bring more stories and live coverage to the eyes of the Ultimate world and, and beyond. beyond. Right now, he's gonna have to bid. Oh, just a, oh, just a football. <laughs> Huge layout block. Unbelievable stuff on the front corner of the end. Zone. Maybe well. just that boost of the energy they needed. The ultimate things in life are free, and we're keeping it that way. Subscribe to keep up with the latest games, tournaments, and community content. Share it with your team and friends, and drop a like to help spread ultimate to more people. Spread the word, spread the love. Okay, my team. Bichon picks up, and they've got a short field. They've got another goal. It's tied up at 12. I can't not believe what goes. I'm seeing. Can here. Lola Dam chase that one down? That is a score for Hashlinger Elferkel. Fantastic run by Julia Lowe. We're on a mission to make Ultimate huge. And we believe that that requires knocking down the paywall. We want our videos and live streams to be free to watch, and we want them to go viral. When you become a member, you enable us to improve our working relationships with tournament organizers, events and federations. And you'll help us to produce live stories for Ultimate fans and to generate new fans with our enhanced content. We, we are, are a group, group of, of Ultimate, Ultimate players, players, coaches and video enthusiasts and we want to bring you coverage on a more consistent basis. We want to make stories that not only reach you, but also reach people outside the Ultimate community. Ciao ragazzi, support the community. Let's subscribe to Ultimate TV, there's lots of the videos, posting, everything, check it out. <laughs> they are the best one. Woo! If you want to grow Ultimate Sports, uh, become a member of Ulti TV. Regardez Ulti TV. Deviens un membre d'Ulti TV et fais grandir ta communauté. Top Ulti TV. Follow me and you'll get me Ultimate of Andromeda. Si quieres ayudar a Ulti TV, puedes ser miembro de Ulti TV. Thumbs up for Ulti Everyone, TV. Everyone, follow Ulti TV on Instagram, on YouTube. They've got everything. Best like, content. Like their pictures if you love frisbee, just do it. You. We're counting on you. Give me a love for Ulti TV. Became member of Ulti TV. Contribute to the development ultimate with Ulti TV. Like and subscribe, Ulti TV, the best in the world. We want to grow ultimate. We want to grow ultimate. We've worked with the major federations and the greatest events. We have our signature style two camera setup with thousands of hours of experience, and our crew is globally dispersed to facilitate coverage everywhere around the world. We can also scale back our broadcast with just one elevated camera. Or scale up with two fields, two cameras, and two commentators on each. We work with local teams and we all have the same mission, to grow the sport and bring it to new people by providing live coverage and new stories. Become a member today on our Patreon page. And, and fund, fund our, our work, work to cover more events in the future and to bring more stories, ideas, and live coverage to the eyes of the ultimate world and, and beyond. beyond. I was called Electric, become a member.
Enjoying the show? Show your support for the live stream and the people making the show. Buy a super chat or super sticker on YouTube directly. Select your donation and type your message to the world. And share. All donations go into directly funding new shows. Buy a super sticker or super chat now. Thank you. We believe mixed is the best for the sport, for the world. That's why we're making a global showcase, starting in Europe, made in Amsterdam. Ultiweek. Ultiweek.net. On the move, you can keep up to date with Ulti TV on all of our social media channels. Like, follow, subscribe, share us with a friend, or send us a message just to say hey. Thank you for supporting us in our mission to grow ultimate everywhere.